Hello there, my beautiful, magical family. Welcome to Moonlight Awakening. My name is Catalina. So today we're going to do the 99 portal. Let's see what, yeah, let's go. What do we need to know, right? So I said the highest intention to receive the guidance and messages that we need for, for September 2022. What does the collective need to know about? The 99 portal. Please and thank you. And and watch for the background just in case any magical things might appear. Okay, so you you guys know. You guys know the drill, right? <laughs> okay, so let's begin. Um first things first, as always, I'll I like to tap into Bill Lameria to know what kind of activations that maybe we might be receiving as well. So, what does the collective need to know about the 99 portal? What does collective need to know about the 99 portal? Three came out. Let's take out more. What does the collective need to know about the 99 portal? Okie doke, let's start. So, total of four. We got freedom. Endless opportunities. Heart chakra. And star seer. Yes, okay. So let's begin with freedom. Yes, right away, you know, there's definitely transformation coming by for all of us. And, and yeah, it's about, you know, you know, sometimes when we feel trapped in certain situations, like it's some, or toxic situations, you know, it's about breaking free from it, setting our soul free, right? So now let's tap into freedom. So if you see me, seeing dragonflies also represents you know signs from the spirit realm deceased loved ones you know um and also so you're you're also your soul is also maturing maturing yeah hopefully <laughs> maturing yeah there you go okay that is also why yeah you're spiritually maturing yeah that's what i meant to say so let's step in let's step in step in the oh, freedom please clarify the freedom okie dokie then wow okay one two three four five six so first things first okay so we got the world a very happy ending coming full cycle spiritual growth and insight so yes it makes a lot of sense why freedom came along so yes yeah, there's definitely the 99 portal we're definitely you know we're going to go through a full cycle you know um sometimes though those tend to be very challenging but you're receiving lots of growth you know, you're seeing things in a different perspective. You're maturing. You're spiritually maturing, right? So that's wonderful. Yeah. And you're going to be very successful. That that cycle that you're going to go through is going to have a happy, happy ending. Okay? So definitely there's nothing for you to be concerned about. Okay? You'll see. You'll see why. You, you're going to be able to see things a lot clearer clear right yeah so time to take that action yes you know this is why it's all about the portal taking that action taking those steps that we need and and jump into your magical unicorn and let's go baby let's all jump into our magical unicorn you know so yes i love unicorns oh, i love when in the cards there's a unicorn there yes yeah like this fellow that's right here yeah so a great deal of activity sudden and immediate results 
important communication. Yeah, it seems like there's you're juggling so many balls or so many things at the same time. This is where the birds also representing freedom, getting your wings and flying, flying away. From, flying away from the toxic job, flying away from the toxic relationship, flying away from any other people, places, or things. You're finally fly, you know, freedom. You're finally flying away. Oh my, like, I'm no, I need to uh, kind of like a baby bird, right? When they start maturing, they need to always learn. You know, they need to start like flying away on themselves, right? No, this is your time to take action and get those wings and fly, my beautiful bird. <laughs> yes, I'm calling you birdies <laughs> or butterflies, whichever you like. So yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, time for you to set free and fly. So whatever's going to happen, you know, it's definitely gonna happen super, super fast. And this is what the nine nine portal is all about. When we're going through portals, can be the most exhausting, the most craziest. When I mean craziest, I mean the most like. It seems like, like you. It's like there's so many things happening, and it can get very exhausting. Again, because I know because during po during the day of portals, I I. I become very exhausted and it just yeah so yeah so yeah they have the changes through this 99 portal look happy ending big happy changes so there's nothing for you to be worrying about you're just going through a full cycle which is how you wish you are getting spiritual growth and insight okay this is what's all about yay i love this one yeah oh my gosh birds ah more birds yeah so if you've been seeing i'll if you're gonna be don't i won't be surprised you keep seeing birds show up in your dreams everywhere you go i really feel like birds are going to definitely be showing you signs and messages for example um last week you know sometimes i see bats in the um around my parents area um they don't live in my parents land but I'm saying like there's a night time I see the bats coming out. But one night, they decide, one decided to fly above me and go in in circles for, for like five whole seconds. Yeah. And then like a few days ago, then I said I was seeing all these hawks all over oh, like all in one day. Again, because other, you know, because this represents a lot of us. Um, again, breaking free. Here we go again, breaking free. So I really, I, I re and more birds and more birds, right? Yeah. So I definitely like. I really feel like you guys are gonna be seeing a lot of bird messages out of nowhere. You see a raven, or you hear the raven, um, or all these your order. You keep seeing all these crows everywhere now or like whatever again because there's birds or cardinals right you're gonna be getting a lot of bird messages i'm gonna tell you yeah so i won't be surprised if you do okay again about make a decision and then take action okay take action kind of like this bird this cage is open clearly because these all the other birds just flew out but this bird thinking that it can't escape, thinking that I'm still trapped, but it's all in the mind. It is all an illusion. It's not, it's not true. It's not real. It's time for you to break free, freedom, free from their mind traps, mind, cage, mind cages, mind illusions. It's time for you to break free. Okay, you can do this. You can get out of this situation. Okay, don't think, stop thinking that you can't. It's all in the mind. Why? Because again, my own experience as well. Okay, yeah. So you can, this is time to get, to get to work. Time to get to work. An excellent opportunity will be offered to you. Scholarships or pursuit of education. Time to get to work, baby. Yes. 
this is why time to get to work time to take that action jump in your unicorn and go if you think you'll be going to school or studying how to be a reiki healer or studying whatever kind of study you want to do this is the time this is what the portal is coming through so you can start stepping into your power what you came here to do okay it's time to step into your power and get out of the head that it okay there's illusions out okay because there's half changes yay okay i was so excited okay speaking of that and that's um yeah and you can and it kind of goes off to the next card where it says endless opportunities yes i'm so excited this is why the new happy changes are coming because endless opportunities creating um bubbles of abundance okay you're gonna create bubbles of abundance you're you're manifesting more things because that you have broke broke free from the mind trap that mind whatever that was holding you back you can finally be like oh my gosh i just i just had to change my mindset and i can create whatever i desire right i just I, sometimes our minds is what get us in our way right and you're gonna keep breaking free from that mind traps okay yeah and and this is you and it's like yes you know now you know no more thinking that that i can't go to school i can't go to school is i need to stop thinking that i'm stupid or i'm not smart enough i am freaking smart enough okay i just need to learn this right you know what i mean the mind gets your own way because i literally have a friend like i don't think i'm smart enough to go to school like well if you think about it like you know when i went to school you think i knew that like for example when i was a teacher you know when i went to be a preschool teacher i went to school for it did i know of course i didn't know nothing about um uh ch um children children you know i didn't know anything so take you know what i mean so i told my friend you came there to learn obviously you don't know anything i wouldn't know none of us are stupid or not smart at all we just don't know we're that's why you're going so you can learn and see what's so you can study okay and now you're like oh my god now i can do anything i set my mind to it i can't do this right and it's opportunities baby and endless opportunities yes so let's take out a card for that one also i'm gonna use my beautiful oracle of for the fairies yes please clarify the endless opportunities okay oh okay never mind there's four i think right yeah 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 yeah. okay yeah okay yeah you know yeah and and knowing that you can shine within right this is a time to shine within and noticing your beautiful powers that's within you okay time to shine within time to let your inner child come out because in your because your inner child doesn't think it twice like i'm going to do that i'm gonna once they set their mind to it like i'm going to do this i'm not gonna think it twice they don't think it twice they go and go for it okay so let your inner child come out this is what it's all about yeah nature signs yes what i was saying don't be surprised you get messages or signs from the bird spirit from the spirit from the bird realm that's what i meant from the bird realm don't be surprised nature signs what did i say oh my gosh look and more beautiful blue butterflies blue butterflies represents definitely abundance as well yes 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 okay so yeah this how beautiful is that yeah nature signs yeah be be perceptive to the subtle messages from nature as you go about your day N nature talks to us content continuously we need only we just need to open our hearts and mind okay so you might be getting more than just bird messages all right you're gonna maybe end up seeing dragonflies on your path you might be gonna see butterflies on your path right nature is speaking all 
all around you okay nature will be speaking to you okay so pay attention to the nature signs yeah 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 lost and found oh my god yes like uh, like i said okay so like remember you you um you're going through this full cycle you are releasing you're removing from those um from those mind traps and mind illusions right and whatever you lost, you're going to be, you're going to find it. Okay, you are going to find it. Even if, you know, you lost, uh, even if, you know, you lost that job or you, or that relationship finally ended or, or any other thing, you will find it whatever the void remember that void is where we're going you're going to shine your light and the void is where you're going to find yourself and the void i mean in that and remember uh that that you will find it maybe you didn't need it anyway maybe you didn't need it anyway maybe that job you know you were you you were no longer longer vi vibrating in that vibration Okay, maybe you didn't need it anyway. Anyway, maybe you didn't need that relationship anyway. Or, or any other thing. Okay, you're going to find what you're looking for, right? So yeah, so beautiful. You will find what you're looking for. What you're searching for, you will find it. This is what it's all about. Yes, yes, yes. And I feel so many chills. Oh, it's very spotty. <laughs> okay, very spotty. Yes, we all want to spot a fairy. And, you, and like, like I did in some of my videos, I have spotted a lot of magical things. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, fairy spotting. It's time to go fairy spotting. It said, it said that seeing is believing, but in fact, believing is seeing. So everything here is nature. Go out in nature. Tap into your inner child wonder. You know what? I wonder what today is going to bring. I wonder what kind of magic is going to show up today. Right? Maybe a bird. Maybe a dragonfly showed up. Maybe a butterfly showed up. Maybe you just spotted a fairy. <laughs> you know? Like. something right kind of like i have right my magical videos that's why i say always keep an eye maybe you're gonna spot a fairy on my videos right yeah but you're gonna find what you're searching for just go out in nature search for those fairies okay search for those fairies as well have beautiful yeah endless opportunities oh so beautiful yes if you endless opportunities maybe like you finally okay also you're like in the in the what if remember this is in the mind trust mind illusions that are not even real like what if you maybe what if you were like um just okay yeah be kind of like this, an inner child ch you know when you're a child you believe in and you believe that every anything is possible so tap into your inner child inner child anything is possible if i set my mind to it it is possible if i want to find a fairy it is possible and i will find a fairy if i want to if I want to find a unicorn, remember, 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 it's about tapping into your inner child. If you, you know, if you tell a unicorn, you know, let's go find a unicorn, and they're all like, yes, let's go, because they know it. Only, be, you know, they haven't seen one, but that doesn't mean that they don't exist. They believe it. Whereas about believing, believing is like they know. They it's, yes, they just know. They just know they are there only because they can't see them, right? So like, you know what? I'm gonna set my mind to it. I'm going to I find someday. I'm going to see a unicorn, and yes, you know, tap into your inner child. Someday, I'm I am going to see a fairy. You know, you you know, and maybe because back then you thought they weren't real, or you didn't believe in, believe in it, or you thought it was crazy. No, a child doesn't think it's crazy. A child thinks that's wonderful. That's amazing. Yes, let's go find ourselves a fairy. Let's go self, uh, find ourselves a unicorn. Let's be a famous painter. You know, they believe it because they know. They believe it. 
You know, if they want to be a famous chef or a baker, or whatever, they know they will get it because they don't think it twice. Like, I know I can. So, by going back to your inner child, knowing that you can. Find a fairy, you will find a unicorn, you will be a successful chef, yes, or whatever, right? Tapping back to your inner child, okay, yes, beautiful. And getting finally breaking away from those mind traps and mind illusions, okay? Take it out, okay? So you can bring endless opportunities and know that anything is possible. It really can because, because of, you know, clearly because of fairies that I captured on video. I've also captured flying feathers. It can also represent the unicorns. They show white feathers when they're around you. So even, even I captured my, my, my unicorn on, on video too. They like to show feathers. So yeah, it is possible. Um, because I haven't seen one that same, but it, it, it did show up. It showed up. Okay. Yes. So anyway, yes, we're also going through the heart healing. Also going through the heart healing. Okay. We need to heal that heart. Maybe, you know, the the inner child uh, traumas, right? It's going tapping back into our heart and following our heart. No more going against your heart. Now you're following. Now, now you're going for it, right? So now let's tap it into the heart chakra. Let's clarify the heart chakra. Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, see, they're confirming everything that I said. It's not just, it's not just, yes. It's just, yes. So even my angels, the fairies, the unicorns are like agreeing everything that I'm saying. They're like, yep, you're one thousand percent correct. It's not just yes, it's yes. <laughs> That's funny. Yes. <laughs> yes, yes. Okay. So I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Okay. Let's keep taking out more, please. What else? Let's clarify the heart chakra. Oh, there's another one. Please clarify the heart chakra okay yeah so yeah it's about you know again it's a uh, it says there's there's a better course of action available to you working alone may may not be the best answer review all details before you start taking an action maybe start depending on your what you're thinking of doing maybe you need to you know talk to someone who is an expert on whatever topic or you want to get into right you want to start your own business you know sometimes it's not like in my or when somebody tells you, oh, I found this job. Yeah, it might look pretty in the outside, but have you really checked the inside? Don't get, you know, it can also be an illusion, you know? You know, some when somebody says, oh, this job is it's good, it's good. And when you go in there, it wasn't really great. It, they were just showing the pretty side. You know what I mean? So checking out the details. So don't go through this new journey alone, okay because your angels and guys so he's like he it's like orange michael he's like pointing that way with his finger over there right over there okay so so yeah um yeah because instead of going to your life where you're instead of going to your highest good the path that is for your highest good you can be going to the path of self destruction destruction you know kind of in this one um yeah like my angel show me show me um the books that i need to read for this topic or that i need to know or give me more information more information show me where to go you know send me that information right send me those people you know asking for help okay ask for help okay i'm also spiritual guide and mentor we can go through this together okay so again you are not alone there's assistance all around you okay and yeah because again look oh seven seven look at that seven seven look at that 
so so yeah like again like because again there's you have to do some de detoxification this is time to make a decision time look how many look decision here time to make a decision here taking action that's a decision um yeah so so yeah so it's time to make a decision okay and detoxify yourself because that's what is holding you back okay um so be clear what you want and take action go in that unicorn jump on that unicorn okay uh so yeah time to take that action make a decision from your heart if your mind and heart are like in both different ways then that's not the best decision they both have to be aligning together right so what is your heart what makes you feel happy when you know like it's like it like what makes you feel happy will this make you feel happy when you or the other thing's gonna make you feel your heart happy which one will make your heart happy going against your heart or following your heart which one sounds happy to you which one makes your heart smile do what do what your heart smiles well your heart smiles yeah your heart does smile <laughs> you know um so it's like seeing from your heart do what makes your heart smile there you go okay and the other one was the emperor the emperor yeah stability and efficient taking charge of the situation ambitious plans yes be like that king making the right decisions okay at the a key to be a great king you have to be making great decisions kings make great decisions sometimes is it sometimes it isn't easy to make decisions but you know that you know you know what you need to do right you know what you need to do okay your heart is telling you your heart is telling you okay okay and because time to change your path time to take charge you want to change your life you want to have your life yes or no then there's some things you need to change you need to take charge you have how can you have a happy life if you're still in that shitty job or in that shitty relationship what you know or whatever that it, relationships can also not just partners it can also be friends family again because they may they're, they're ruining your happy life well guess what maybe they just just weren't meant to be with you right now you know maybe in the future but maybe not right now if they're really you know or so yeah so you have to be just be very aware okay just be be clear what you want the see from the eyes of the heart see from the eyes of the heart and believe that you will manifest okay now like oh i hope so. when you you if you're watching this video and saying well i hope so i hope i hope what you're saying is correct i i just really want to manifest i hope i just wish i hope so you know you're saying i hope no woman you will get you will be there stop saying i hope so well i hope no <laughs> again maybe that's part of this mind trap illusion thinking that uh, i hope so it's like saying maybe it's like saying that maybe it's going to happen but i hope so it's like saying it's a maybe no it's not for sure it's not for sure thing it's not a maybe take that i hope so i hope so no it's a yes <laughs> <laughs> it's a yes it's a yes okay there's no i hope or oh, maybe no it is it is because again everything's working in your favor a child know that it is going to work they don't think well i hope so no <laughs> they just know it is going to work okay so <laughs> <sighs> yes hopefully um anyway so and i'm being silly and i'm making you laugh good good we all need a little laughter in our lives right a little laughter so there you go okay okay 
So let's begin, okay? So stop, stop saying I hope so. No, it is. It is going to happen. It is, it is. Not I hope so, I hope so. No, it is, it is, and it is, you know? You know, because everything's working in your favor. The universe is working for you, okay? Not I, ho I hope it is, you know? No, this is why you're in this, this is why your mind's in the cage in the first place, okay? Because you didn't believe in yourself. That it will happen okay so yeah third out <laughs> anyway no no i'm not really gonna throw out away my card it was just a symbolism okay people okay now throw away my card okay so anyway star seer yes being guided you know sh you're gonna it's like they're guy they're your beautiful guys and angels your unicorns your fairies are going to help you reach for the stars reach for your dreams and they'll taking you there your higher self you know they're gonna give you one step at a time but make sure which which path are you taking your highest good or self-sabotage Again, just be very well, be very well, aware which one are you taking, okay? Ask for help. Ask for assistance. Ask a, a professional that knows about that topic that you want to know. Someone that that knows, right? You know, do research. You know, ask your angels and guides, your higher self, right? So again, because they will take you there. They are taking you there, just little steps at a time, okay? But just trust because they got your back, okay? And um, and speaking of, since there's a unicorn here, we're gonna pull out a unicorn message, <laughs> okay? Um. Uh, uh, you, uh, to clarify the star seer so my unicorn please clarify the star seer okay thank you my unicorn divine potential yes 35 fulfill your destiny be all you can be fulfill your destiny be all you can be again because again following your destiny you're following your heart it is your destiny you're leading they're leading you to your destiny when you're following your heart you're following your destiny so be all you can be don't hold yourself back those people don't deserve you they're the if they're holding you back maybe because they didn't deserve you okay and whatever your whatever that loss that you're feeling or emptiness you will find it Okay, you can also call ask the lost and found fairy. My my beautiful, uh, you know, I call forward the the lost and found fairy. Please help me find um um this loss that I'm feeling. Please help me find a new job that will make me more happy and fulfilled. You know, whatever that loss is, right? Okay, yes, beautiful. Because it is written, okay? It's written in the stars for you, okay? Create your vision, yes. Creativity, number three. Creativity, co-creation. Look, and there's a path. <gasps> and there's a path. And there's a path, like here, like a path. And there's another path, right here. And there's another path. Um, and yeah. So the unicorns wants to tell you, do what makes your heart sing. Oh my gosh. You're being snudged, snudged forward. Do what makes your heart sing. You're being nudged forward. You're being nudged forward. Because why? You're following your heart. You're finally making decisions from your heart. So beautiful wow yes and follow that path from your heart not a self-sabotage mm -mm. this person is not listening to their heart there's persons avoiding their heart but there's gonna be a beautiful happy ending happy changes that you're searching for because you are taking that action 
you are taking that action, you decided to follow your heart in jumping on that unicorn, okay? Because you know it will make you very happy and fulfilled and you're going towards your mission and you're going towards your purpose and your destiny. Oh, I love it. Okay. So anyway, and also if you would like to, to join uh, my Patreon page, I'm doing a lot behind the scenes. of being a vendor. You also get free readings, like, and free energetic healing. Um, you can win some of my handmade creation, just like this beautiful moon right here. Yes. Or if you're interested in my, any of my handmade creations, I will leave my Facebook and my Instagram and my email as well. Okay. So please check out, please see below this video. Okay. For those details. Okay. If you have any questions also about any readings, also, if you want your own personal reading, if you want your beautiful uh, fairy readings, or if you want your own angel readings or, or energetic readings, what I just did right now, definitely hit me up. If you have any questions also about any of the stuff that I do, don't, uh, yeah, don't be afraid to message me if you have any questions. Anyway, I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys next time.